Hey, welcome back to the channel. Just returned from the post office and I have recently made an order from cheapest NATO straps. And uh, they're not all NATO straps, but I had a uh, moment where I just wanted to order up some straps, some fresh straps. And there is a bit of a thing behind them all. If you aren't already paying attention camo 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 canvas camo nato khaki two-piece khaki uh camo um sorry canvas canvas camo camo velcro and another different camo nato yeah, just wanted to give them a try, check them out, and um, they had some pretty great prices on, so here they are, and I ordered them all in 22 millimeter because uh, currently I am enjoying my Bell and Ross BR V2-92 in the military uh, green. I think this is their vintage collection. Uh, it is their vintage collection. And so I was jonesing for some military, some camo uh, sort of pieces to see what that looked like. And already I'm pretty stoked. This is where I'm going with it. And uh, initial initial uh, impressions, first impressions, this one's a little flimsy. Uh, by comparison, this is an RSM that's currently on the Bell and Ross. So RSM, uh, they're like fabric gurus, but um, let's try out some of these on the B&R. And I immediately like this uh, for looks. Let's try it on for comfort. Let's see what we have. Alright, so it is pretty comfortable. I would compare it to the uh, RSM for quality, uh, for comfort. Uh, quality yet to be decided. That feels good. Mm, it's a little bit flimsier. Uh, but, we'll give it a go, see what it's like. It's, um, you know, single pass NATO, and at $5.95. Yeah, you might uh, be tempted, like I was, to give it a go. Um, this one I wanted to try out because it's a little bit of a distressed canvas look. Um, I also really like that look. Let's see, again, it's a little stiffer than the other one. The other one's a little bit softer fabric. Oh, I thought I had it. Also, a, yeah, I like that. I do. So I've got a seven and a half inch wrist for your reference. And that is coming all the way through. It is a little tight. Let's see, at one loop. And this is sort of your more traditional standard NATO style strap with the uh, the uh, under the uh, I guess the ear, the dog ear, the pigtail sticking out underneath, as uh, you see there. Alrighty. Dummy, I put it in upside down. Alrighty, so I had it in upside down. 
slide down the first time, had to switch it. And here we are, whoops, in camera. So that is a very light, very comfortable strap immediately. Um, but in just that strap switch, uh, now it's pretty fast pulling it through. Let's see if that's gonna, I don't know if you can see that. The edge of it's already starting to uh, sort of peel out. Um, but there you go. But I do like that one. Uh, it's very light. And I do like Velcro. I had a Velcro strap a long time ago, even as a teenager, on a Timex Iron Man, and I really did like that. So uh, I like this one. And it does fit comfortably on wrist. There's a little bit of a, of a, let's see what it looks like. Oops, there we go. Okay, the next two are quick release. They came as quick releases from, uh, from uh, Cheapest Nano Straps. And uh, if you remember a while ago, Dave over at Just the Watch Dave YouTube channel did like an Olympics thing. Yeah, I wouldn't have uh, I wouldn't have won any races or awards there on that one because uh, it's uh, I'm just fumbling all over the place here. Hmm. So these are 22s, and the fabric is just slightly. Pushed off there. So I immediately like that look. And uh, it's canvas top. I'm really hoping it's going to break in well. My only problem with. <laughs> Shit. The only problem with two piece straps for me is I typically find them a little too small. It's like. Uh, yeah. So I'm at the uh, second to last hole. There's the. Uh, that one hole and uh, that's a seven and a half inch wrist people uh, so I always find them to be a touch short but boy oh boy I do like uh, that camo look on this uh, v2-92 boy that is nice I do like it alrighty Now, oh, let's get this khaki one again, a canvas strap with genuine leather backing. And so I believe in the world of leather, that is the cheapest leather or lowest grade of leather, genuine leather. leather. Um, very nice again. Oops. Very nice. Again, I do like that one. Um, I've got some other watches that uh, I'm going to look forward to putting these straps on to. Uh, so there you go. Again, very solid. I do like that uh, green color. It's a military khaki green. So yeah that is uh that's five straps from uh cheapest nato straps they have a wide range of offerings on their website and um i've always wanted to give it a go check them out and so here it is i think my favorite quickly initial uh, first impressions the traditional NATO here. This, uh, I suppose I should check it out. Alrighty, so we've got the uh, single pass strap Jacquard or Jacquard camo. We've got a NASA Velcro single pass with canvas, so camo canvas. We've got two piece canvas. 
in camo and, and uh, military green. And then we've got the, let's see which one this is. Yep, this is the camo. Camo, uh, just their NATO strap. NATO strap, camo. So, it's not one of their premium ones. I believe it was only like $5 for it. So, there you go. The uh, five straps, check them out. So, that's uh, immediate first uh, impressions. We will have another update at another time for how well they're holding up. I am concerned about the uh, Velcro already because uh, the edges here started fraying immediately. But uh, it appears to be uh, very light, and I am looking forward to wearing that one. Alrighty.